I feel like people who are here are refugees, or they're, by and large, people are, are here fleeing from something or uh, hiding from something, that they've been chased away from various places um, in mainstream Christianity and even not mainstream Christianity. And they found their way here, and so here we all are in this kind of refugee camp and uh, finding out that we're not the only ones and that there are other people here who are uh, saying the same stuff and asking the same questions. I'm here all the way from Denver, Colorado. I've come a long way, but I'm kind of a native of this area. I grew up in North Carolina. I went to Mars Hill College, which is just over the mountain. And so I'm here actually with uh, some youth from my church. We're on about a two week um, trip on ecology and spirituality. We've looked at lots of different ecosystems all across the state of North Carolina, and we've started in the, in the east and we've moved to the west. And so this is something like day 12, I think, of our trip. And we came to the Wild Goose to see what's going on here and the kinds of um, attention to ecology and spirituality we can find from folks here. Uh, the Wild Goose for me is a place to find people who are asking the same kind of questions and speaking the same kind of language that, that, that I am. Um, you know, it's easy when you're out there sort of in, in the world to feel like you're the only one asking these kinds of questions, the only one um, seeing what's going on in the church and, and saying, is this really the way it's supposed to be? And you get to the wild goose and lo and behold, there's thousands literally of people who are asking the same kinds of questions, using the same language, dissatisfied in all the same ways, uh, disgruntled in all the same ways. And it's kind of a nice community to, to get to and realize you're not alone, that there are other people like you. And I enjoy being here for that reason.